Did you know that Ashoka the Great suffered from a rare genetic skin disorder? The condition is known as neurofibromatosis or von Recklinghausen's disease which leads to the formation of tumors on the nerve tissue. The development of tumor which grow as multiple palpable rubbery developments in the skin can occur at any place within the nervous system including the nerves, spinal cord and even within the brain. The disorder is rare but its many cases have come to light in India time and again. One such patient of neurofibromatosis is a 54-year-old resident of UP's Agra, Subhash Chand. He developed the disorder at the age of just 20 years. Though his disorder is same as Ashoka's, but his condition is much worse. Unlike Ashoka, neurofibromatosis has left Subhash with half lips as well as a missing eye and ear on the right side of his face. Whoever comes across Subhash immediately tries to distance them from him. He is unable to see, eat or speak properly. People make fun of him and call different names. But despite the various problems he faces on day-to-day -day basis, Subhash manages to stay positive about life. One major reason behind his smile is the scientific developments over the period of time on the disorder, making neurofibromatosis curable to some extent. Now what are the symptoms of neurofibromatosis? Around half of neurofibromatosis cases are inherited from a parent and the other half occurs spontaneously. Early symptoms include flat brown birthmarks and lumps and bumps in unusual places. It is also associated with mild learning difficulties. And how does its treatment go? The treatment of neurofibromatosis begins with diagnosis of the symptoms of the patient. Many recent researchers have tried to find out several medications to help improve the conditions of patients. However, the effectiveness of these methods of treatment has not yet been full proven. The most effective treatment till date is carbon dioxide laser treatment. The CO2 laser has been shown to be effective in treating large numbers of small to medium sized neurofibromatosis with cosmetic outcomes equal to or even better than surgical excision. However, evidence for CO2 effectiveness, effect of treatment on patient satisfaction and rate of recurrence post-treatment is scarce. Recent studies have also come up with various natural medications, avoiding sugar and other carbohydrates and consumption of cannabis oil, other products of cannabis, aloe vera juice, anti-angiogenesis herbs, green tea, liposomal curcumin are a few natural ways that have been helpful. Yes, neurofibromatosis can be tackled to some extent at present stage of medical science advancements and can be controlled at the early stages. Emperor Ashoka was not so fortunate to have advanced medical assistance like today, but many like Subhash have hopes for a better tomorrow.